on that. But yeah, you're right. The wear and tear for these two have got to be wearing on a bit now. They've got to get a pinfall. And the ideal person would be to be on each other. Oh, look at this. Springboard attack by Bomberman off the ropes. Landed on top of Rouge. Not the best way to land on top of her, but it certainly created a bit of uh, trouble for Rouge. Especially on the getting up factor. And now Bomberman on the uh, wrong side of town. As the Tails can come into play on that side. Wait a minute. Rouge with these furious, furious kicks. And Bomberman is down. Oh, he's back up though, but only at the hands of Rouge. Wait a minute. And another load of kicks, and uh, that even shook Tails off his perch there. Come on, Rouge, you're set and primed. Pin him. And Mannix intervening now. Bomb Man needs to get back over to uh, the friendly corner. Oh man, because otherwise Bomb Man's going to have a hard time with Tails and Rouge here in the other corner. Wait a minute. Now he's there, but now he's in a precarious situation. Oh man, Rouge just speared Manic off the perch. And what a series of shots right in the corner there. If it's one thing Rouge is really good at, it's those kicks. And boy, did she ever just deliver some to Bowman while he was in the corner. That's got to make him sore tomorrow. Oh, Rouge shot again to unleash a fury of kicks, but Manic got involved there on that one. Wait a minute. She's rolled up Bowman here. Oh, Manic was right there. He, he really is thinking several moves ahead. It's like he's there whenever they get a pin. Like magic. Being a bit of a chess player, you can tell what you're going to do before you do it. But nonetheless, here we go. There's another pin attempt by Rouge because she's putting them all up and wow, she just got it. And there's a pin full for Rouge. And now she's back and oh no, this means bad news for the uh, anti-heroes uh, leader who's now, uh, as you say, in a handicap situation. He's got no one to tag out to. And he's still got to face Bomberman and Manic here, who have been this, in this match the longest uh, compared to Tails. He hasn't been in a lot of action in this match so far, so I guess that could favour him. We'll just have to wait and see. Wait a minute, Tails trying to go for a headlock, but uh, Manic reversed it into a backdrop, and now trying to hammer him into the corner. Manic knows how to throw weapons, but he also knows how to throw punches. There's no denying that. And a big forearm shot there before he mounts up into that position in the corner. And once again, swinging those fists, connecting with Tails' face. Uh, the uh, the advantage of being this in this handicap situation now is now Tails is the only person left to get this pinfall and win for his team. But he's got to overcome this handicap situation now. But the tagging is still all legal in the case of Manic and Bomberman. They still have to tag in and out. But it's all Tails all the way from now on. And Tails can be exceptionally evil when it comes to when he's backed into a corner. Oh, what a shot! Oh man, Manic bringing in weapons and using them to good effect and Tails just flew to the outside of the ring after that assault. Wait a minute, Manic! Oh look, showing that he can fly and uh, jumps into Tails on the outside and the suplex afterwards not gonna do good favors for Tails' back Manic with that fire extinguisher just squirting in his face man he is turning this into a street fight now he is he's got the chance to of course uh, if whoever pins Tails out of this one if they do it's going to be easy for the other person to get a pin on Tails as well because he's going to be pinnable material after this. Wait a minute. Manic says you can't see me and bang! What a fist drop there right in the face. Take, Tails has taken a, a, a lot of biddings to his uh, cranial area. Wait a minute. Oh. But uh, Ballman comes in and Tails has capitalized. He rolled around and right into that back body drop at a high angle but Bowman comes back fighting with those big fists of his 
Wait a minute, Bomb ran into a strong grapple, but no, Tails reversed right round into a hammerlock. Tails is a submission expert, let's not forget that. Well, let's not forget that, he's going to be looking for a body part to wear down, and whoa, Bowman almost got a pinfall there after that uh, sunset flip over the ropes. But, yeah, as you point out, Tails has got to be looking for a weakness in one of these two. You only have to bit, pin one of them, and then you're through. And Tails would have won this match. Wait a minute. After that interesting maneuver, and Tails has been pinned, which means, uh, well, Bowman has scored the pinfall. Which means we're down to, oh god, it's Manic and Tails. The person who gets the pinfall in this one. And that is going to be it. Wait a minute, Tails. Oh man, big shot rolling around Manic on the back of his head. Trying to capitalize here on the early going between these two. He's the freshest. Oh, not after that he won't be. Moonsault missed. And, but he comes back and d delivers a huge shoulder block to Manic. Now they get back into the ring. Wait a minute. Oh, big drop kick. Now Tails, come on. Saying, come on. I can take you on. I've beaten you before, Manic, and I'm going to do it here again. As uh, he delivers a swing and net breaker. And then again, with the Irish whip. And, oh man, Manic countered with a shot to the gut. It all comes down to this. But that wear and tear has got to be affecting Manic. He's been in this match longer than he has than Tails has. So Tails has got the advantage here in this one, despite the handicap he just got. He's the more fresher guy in my view. Especially after Manic's been taking so much of abuse so far from Tails. And uh, just uh, squeezing him down in the corner before uh, squirting that fire extinguisher in his face and then, oh man, wax him with the fire extinguisher afterwards. It's all legal, no disqualifications. These two are looking for a pinfall or a submission. Tails, in my view, would be looking for a submission. For sure, he'd love to make Manic tap out again, especially with that leg injury he's got. I can see an ankle lock in uh, moments away. And wait a minute, Tails is not going for an ankle lock, he's going more for the arms with that cross arm bar. Hey, any submission is a good submission. And now Manic trying to equalize the score here by these thunderous shots right in the back of Tails. While he had him held there, wait a minute, oh, nearly got a pin there, that would have been it. What an epic night it's been here, folks, so far. 